We're going to make it clear that anyone collecting unemployment who is offered a suitable job must take the job or lose their unemployment benefits. There are a few COVID-19 related exceptions, so the people aren't forced to choose between their basic safety and a paycheck. But otherwise, that's the law. I know there's been a lot of discussion since Friday, since Friday's report, that people are being paid to stay home rather than go to work. Well, we don't see much evidence of that. That is a major factor. We, we don't see that, that — look, it's easy to say the, the line has been, because of the generous unemployment benefits, that it's a major factor in labor shortages. Americans want to work. Americans want to work. I think the people who claim Americans won't work, even if they find a good and fair opportunity, underestimate the American people. So we'll insist that the law is followed with respect to benefits, but we're not going to turn our backs on our fellow Americans. 22 million people lost their jobs in this pandemic through no fault of their own. They lost their jobs to a virus and to a government that bungled its response to the crisis and failed to protect them. We still have 8 million fewer jobs than we did when the pandemic started. And for many of those folks, unemployment benefits are a lifeline. No one should be allowed to game the system. And we'll insist the law is followed, but let's not take our eye off the ball. Families. Families who are just trying to put food on the table, keep a roof over their head, they aren't the problem. We need to stay focused on the real problems in front of us, beating this pandemic and creating jobs. Again, the law is clear. If you're receiving unemployment benefits and you're offered a suitable job, you can't refuse that job and just keep getting the unemployment benefits.